Today, I'm going to show you how to paint these wooden peg dolls. To start with, I'm going to use gesso. Gesso is a white paint mixture that is used on canvas as a base paint. After covering it with gesso, I'm going to paint them with a clean layer of white acrylic paint as well. But before applying the white acrylic paint, I'm going to use an emery paper over the wooden pieces because of which the wooden pieces get a smooth surface that helps the color paint spread evenly on this surface, giving it a polished As you can see, the surface here is pretty rough. After using an emery sheet over this, you can see the difference. Now that the surface is smooth and clean, I've applied a single coat of white acrylic paint. I've used some basic acrylic paints that I had from a very long time with me. I also tried to smoothen the paint with my brush on the palette itself before applying it directly from the tube. I paint the dolls or try to give a similar color combination. Whereas here, I'm trying to do a guy with a black suit and I'll probably give a bow tie in a purple shade so that it matches with the other doll as well. After finishing the major color coverage, it's time to get into the details. I've made a very light sketch using a pencil. Then I carefully painted the details using a much smaller sized brush. I didn't really have a proper skin tone color for, to paint over these dolls. Instead, I made my own color by mixing three different colors which had more of white and a bit of yellow and red. And for some dolls, I tried using white with a very little bit amount of yellow in them. You can experiment with the hair though, styling them with different color dresses, accessorizing them and make them look the way you want. It's just how you want them to look. You want them to look cute, you want them to look very stylish. It's all up to you after you finish the main basic color coats. Also, I would like to thank Peli Pulajara for sending over these wooden peg dolls to paint. I really enjoy doing these in my free time and also it's been really long since my last YouTube video. I'll try to shoot and post as often as I can. And I really hope you liked this video. Take care, until next time.